hi guys my name is joanne and welcome to my channel so in today's video i'll be showing you guys how to mount your photos on the wall uh, so you don't have to drill your walls we are going to use a mounting tape and that's what i'm going to show you guys how to go about it these are my wedding photos and it's still a work in progress i still have more photos to mount on the wall and other fancy photos but so far this is what we have and i'll be showing you how to achieve this look uh let me just get up close this is how it looks on the wall it's well secured on the wall so it's not going to fall off and i just used a mounting tape by the way this is my crochet wedding dress i hope to do a video about it very soon so let's just dive straight into the video i got my frames from house of leather the nairobi town branch the big one was going for kenyan shillings 500 bob the medium one was Kenyan shillings 400 bob and then the small one was going for Kenyan shillings 300 bob. So the next thing I'm going to do is attaching my photos inside the frame. I really love these frames. It's a shimmery golden frame and it has a glass on top of it. You will also need a mounting tape. This is the mounting tape I'm talking about. I got this from House of Leather as well for Kenyan shillings 200 bob. It's double-sided tape and it can hold up to 900 grams, nothing more than that. So the next thing we're going to do is sketching the frames on our wall, like the plan of how you would want your frames to look on your wall. So that's what I'm doing right here. I'm using a pencil. Uh, something that you can rub in case you make a mistake and then I'm just going to try aligning my photos how I would love them to look on my wall so this is what I am doing right now <music> Once you're done sketching, uh, take your mounting tape and attach it onto your photo frame just along the edges. Uh, after attaching, just press it down to stick so well, cut off the excess, uh, repeat the process onto the other edges part of it and that's all. After that, peel off the top part of the mounting tape, but kindly do not overlap your mounting tape on top of the other. That's the mistake I did here because it's going to be bumpy and it's not going to stick so well on your wall. So once you're done, the next thing we're going to do is to attach our photo on the wall. Just press it hard and that's it. <laughs> So just press, 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 press until it sticks so well on the wall. So let's fix the second frame. Kindly, uh, like I said before, do not overlap your mounting tape on top of the other. I think I was so excited to make this video for you guys until I made this mistake. And kindly do not do that. But the rest of my frames were okay. I just made the mistake on the first and the second frame. And uh, at this point, if your frame has a backrest, you can actually remove it. But for me, I want to get rid of it because uh, I still had plans for these frames. And that's why I just decided to overlap the mounting tape on top of that backrest thing so once you're done we're just going to peel off the upper part of it and then stick it on the wall continue pressing 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 yes and that's it <laughs> So 
this is our final product guys kindly comment down below let me know where do you normally buy your photo frames and also how do you normally fix your photos on the wall without necessarily damaging your wall and kindly remember to subscribe uh let's interact on the comment section see you in my next video goodbye